Hello, my name is Simon Seligman and I've been a lecturer for the Art Society for 25 years on and off. I'm sitting on the banks of the River Derwent in Derbyshire's beautiful Peak District, where I'm lucky enough to live. And just a few miles downstream from here lies the great treasure house of Chatsworth, the home of the Cavendish family, the Dukes and Duchesses of Devonshire. And Chatsworth is the subject of many of my current lectures. When I was 12 years old, I was given this wonderful book, The Great Houses of Britain. And in the middle of it is a photograph of a building I'd never seen or heard of before, Chatsworth. And I vowed pretty much from that day on that when I grew up, for some reason I didn't fully understand, I was going to work in this building. So you can imagine how extraordinary it was for me at the age of 25, with an art history degree, to accept a summer job opportunity at Chatsworth and then to stay for 19 years, eventually as Head of Communications. In that time, I grew to know the house, its landscape, its collections and its story intimately well, and I was lucky enough to start lecturing about it all over the world. I lecture on the evolution of the collection, told chronologically through the history of the family, reflecting the tastes and the patronage of each generation, and I tell a similar story on the evolution of the garden and the park landscape. A third lecture focuses in on the period since 1950 when Andrew, the 11th Duke of Devonshire and his wife Deborah, transformed Chatsworth from the ashes of death duties and made it one of the most loved, most visited and most emulated historic estates, not just in this country but in Europe. That story ends in the present day with the vast amount of conservation and restoration undertaken by the present uh, 12th Duke and Duchess of Devonshire and reflects also their passion for contemporary art, furniture, sculpture, and much more besides. My newest lecture relating to Chatsworth tells the story of one of the greatest figures associated with its history, Debo Mitford, Deborah, the Duchess of Devonshire. Debo was my first boss and became then a mentor, patron, and a dear friend. I loved her enormously and learned a huge amount from her. And women's stories are often overlooked in the history of the English country house. And so I tell the story of her life and the transformative impact she, with her extraordinary Mitfordian energy, her acumen, her style, her wit and her passions, helped to transform Chatsworth into the place that we all know and love today. It was a great life and it's an enormous pleasure to share it with an audience. Thank you.